Good evening. Several businesses in Old Town started off the year cleaning up after several businesses were vandalized overnight. The criminals shattering dozens of windows and causing thousands in damages. News 13's Alexis Kineski is live in Old Town Albuquerque with that story. Alexa. Brittany, it's an eerie scene in Old Town tonight. It's usually crowded during the holiday season, but now lines of windows boarded up after this weekend's destruction. And businesses say they're not surprised. This was not the way happy hikers in Old Town was hoping to ring in the new year. A suspect breaking into the shop around 4.30 in the morning on New Year's Day. He rushed behind my counter and just stole my drawer, which had like $2 in it. I hope it was worth it for him. Now manager Nathan Cowan is left picking up the pieces again, this time five months after a previous break-in. Waking up on New Year's Day to just a photo of how much glass was all over my store was really disheartening. Now, less than 24 hours after Happy Hikers was initially vandalized, several other businesses in Old Town were hit, all spending the morning boarding up windows that were smashed in. Like Old Town Cafe, who had their front window busted. I mean, they're breaking into a restaurant when they're going to steal her beans and rice or, you know, it's kind of silly. Alan Vincioni, who manages dozens of properties in Old Town, says he's not surprised it happened. For the past year and a half, he says the careless vandalism has been out of control. Kind of expected on holidays is when the shops are closed and so the, the you know, the mice will play, I guess, when the cats are away. For now, businesses like Happy Hikers will clean up and sadly wait for the next break in the the unfortunate thing is is it's going to happen again um, we're sure someone else will try something else in the future so we're just here to make sure it takes them longer um, to get in and out and that they walk away with less stuff now we reached out to apd on this we did not hear back Brittany, back to you all right, thank you, Alexa. Happy Hiker says it is going to cost more than $3,000 to fix their front door. Other businesses that were vandalized did not report anything missing from inside their stores.